Cambridge Amateur Boxing Club, or better known as Campol ABC, was formed in 1974 by serving police officer Mick Taylor, along with two other fellow police officers, Inspector Peter Bullen and Superintendent Roy Hardingham. It was intended to develop young police cadets into a boxing squad. Success quickly followed when police teams versus universities from Cambridge and Oxford produced thrilling events. Civilian boxers from Somersham Amateur Boxing Club, Mick's former club, joined Campbell ABC to give experience to young police cadets. This was the start of the link between local people and the police. Hello then, my name is Mick Taylor. I'm the head coach and organiser and founder of the Cambridge Police Amateur Boxing Club. We've now been going for a total of 34 years and uh, really we're still going quite strong. We train three times a week, once on a Thursday night at this location and again on a Sunday for the boxers and potential boxers and then on a Monday night which was in conjunction with the Crime and Disorder Bill at the Medway Community Centre which is in the middle of Huntingdon. The club gives me that extra energy and that will and the want to always be here. I mean I think that every young person whether they be seven years of age or 37 years of age is a very very important person for the club. I'm Chris Baker. I help run Campole Amateur Boxing Club with um, Mick Taylor. I'm the club secretary, boxer for the club for now 23 years about approximately. Um, had over 70 club fights and won most of them and national champion, international fights for um, um, the ABA as well as um, various different police organisations. Um, do I think I do a good job? Do a great job. I'm a fantastic coach. The best coach at the club, without a shadow of a doubt. Um, but no, yeah, we do do a good job. We're all a team at the end of the day. A, we've got four or five assistant coaches, um, two full coaches, mix and advanced coach. But yeah, we do a fantastic job. Just um, we need more boxers. Do I think the club um, members appreciate our work? Not during the session they don't appreciate our work, no. They feel it's some complete pain and um, we're the, the devils in disguise. Um, but hopefully they appreciate once they've, they've had a, a win in the ring after a competition, they, then they appreciate what we do for them. for about eight months now. I've had one fight and uh, what I like about boxing is that it gets all your anger out and it's good because it's good fitness and all the trainers put a lot of effort into everything that goes on and they don't force you in, into anything that you don't want to do. It's like you work at your own pace. I've been boxing for about ten years. Uh, hard training on that. Uh, coaches are alright know what they're doing, um, well experienced and that, uh, what have you, as you can see, hard sparring, and uh, I'm glad the night's over. Oh.
of a doubt. Um, but no, yeah, we do do a good job. We're all a team at the end of the day. As if we've got four or five assistant coaches, um, two full coaches, mix and advanced coach. But yeah, we do a fantastic job. Just um, we need more boxers, more competitive boxers. Do I think the club um, members appreciate our work? Not during the session they don't appreciate our work, no. They feel it's some complete pain and um, we're the, the devils in disguise. Um, but hopefully they appreciate once they've, they've had a, a win in the ring after a competition, they, then they appreciate what we do for them. So I think they do appreciate it deep down. But at the time, no, they don't. I think that's all your questions.